All right, thank you, Spencer. It is now nine minutes after. In the baseball playoff, the San Francisco Giants and Minnesota Twins are in the catbird seat. The Giants beat the St. Louis Cardinals 6-3 to three yesterday to take a three games to two lead in the National League Series. And the Twins beat the Detroit Tigers 5-3 to three last night to move ahead three games to one in the American League Series. Our playoff correspondent, Willie Starger, was on hand for that game. He joins us this morning from WXYZ-TV in Detroit. Good morning, Willie. Good morning, Joan. I don't imagine there's a whole lot of joy there in Motown today. Well, uh, there wasn't much joy going on in Detroit, but there was certainly an awful lot of joy going on in the Minnesota clubhouse. And I guess for one reason, uh, if, if nothing else, for a lot of these young players, this is the first time for them in the playoffs. And last night, I had a chance to talk with Greg Gagne, and I wanted to know what was going through his mind during these pressure games. The thoughts that go through your mind out here, uh, you know, you have to have confidence out here to play. You have to believe in yourself. Um, sometimes there's doubts, and uh, you get down and discouraged sometimes, and you have to uh, forget about them. You have to believe, you know, keep believing, keep believing, and, and, and just go out there and do it. Two very big hits tonight. Uh, could have been three. Your contributions. Give us a little talk about that. Well, I'm just... I'm just happy, real happy right now uh, that, first of all, that we won the game, you know. Um, it's a battle out there. Uh, a lot of things go through your mind and everything. Um, I'm just happy that I could contribute to, to a winning cause tonight. The Puck, as his teammates affectionately refer to him as, been doing it all year. And tonight, he got a great big home run. It did wonders for himself and, of course, for his teammates. Kirby in the third inning, that big home run to tie up the ball game. But what did that do for you personally? Well, I, I've been struggling the whole series, Will. I think I was start, start, starting to think a little bit too much of the play instead of just going up and doing it. Mm -hmm. And I just went up and just let the, uh, you know, just let the bat go. That time was a good pitch for Frank Sinana, but uh, I went down and got it. it was a Tell me about the team reaction here. Well, the team is great, Will. I mean, we, when you come into a series, nobody expected us to win the West. We're underdogs here in, in, in the league championship series, and Tom Kelly just told everybody, just go out and just play the way you've been playing all year, and, uh, you know, that's what we've been doing. You said something about Tom Kelly. Could you just talk briefly about him for a moment, Kirby? Well, he's the kind of manager, Will, that, uh, you know, back in your day, I think you would have enjoyed playing for him. Uh, he doesn't ask much, much of you. He actually just come to the park, prepare yourself to play, and give 100%, and that's all you can do, and that's the, the guys are responding to that. Does the team feel that they can win five now, right here? I think so. Uh, I think you got to feel like that. you got to uh, give this push right now. Um, we've got to come out here tomorrow. Uh, we ain't going to try to lose the game tomorrow. We're going to be trying to win it. And uh, maybe we're, we're, we'll taste it. Uh, I think we got that taste right now. We just have to uh, go out and do it and be hungry tomorrow. Well, I'm thinking about the Tigers' loss, I just have to ask you about Darrell Evans. It was just not his night last night. What happened? Well, well Darrell Evans did have a tough night last night. You know, getting picked off in the sixth inning was a huge mistake. That it came back to haunt the Tigers. And right after that, Sparky moved him from first to third, where he played as awkward as he, uh, as he could. And we all have these kind of days that Darrell had last night. And as a player, you just don't want to have it in a game like this it's just too important for the Tigers. But Dell has been through this before, and, uh, you know, he's a professional. Quietly, he's their team leader, and this is the team that has the best record in baseball. So there's a lot of professionals. They're looking forward to going out there today and, and doing the things they've been doing all year. All right, Willie, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Of course, the National League will be back in St. Louis tomorrow night for Game 6 also. Uh, coming up right now on uh, 13 after the hour, yesterday's game march on Washington right after this.